So to begin solving this problem, you want to look at this number over here, the 4, and you want to find all the factors for 4. So for example, 4 can be 4 times 1, or it can also be 2 times 2, and these are the only two factors. Now, to solve this problem, you want to find the factors that when multiplied equal 4 and when added together they equal 4 so if we add 4 and 1 this will equal to 5 so we don't want that because this is not 4 so you find 2 to add 2 is 4 so the factors we want is 2 times 2 so if you factor this problem you get x plus 2 times x plus 2 the plus 2's come from our two factors, the 2 and 2, equals to 0. So if you were to expand these two brackets, you would come up with the exact same thing as x squared plus 4x plus 4. So if we want to solve our problem, we want to find an x value that will give us a bracket which equals to 0, because anything times 0 is 0, so we have x equals to negative 2 because negative 2 plus 2 is 0, so 0 times this bracket equals 0. And for our bracket, we also have x equals to negative 2, so in this case, we only have one solution. So if we want to double check our answer, we substitute negative 2 back into the equation to see if the left-hand side equals to 0 as well. So we have negative 2 squared plus 4 times negative 2 plus 4 and if this is true it's supposed to equal to 0 so what do we have? Neg negative 2 squared is 4 4 times negative 2 is negative 8 plus 4 so as you can see 4 plus 4 is 8 minus 8 is 0 therefore negative 2 is the solution